Forza, more news. I engaged another Calvardian squad, but they managed to slip away. Yes, and it seemed like there was something very wrong with them. They didn't speak a word and left at us like a pack of beasts. Even I had to get a little serious. But they managed to hold their own for a moment before suddenly vanishing. No. We've searched the area thoroughly, and there don't seem to be any secret passages whatsoever. They were enveloped in a red light, and their presence completely vanished. This is Randy. We've got activity on our end. We ran into some weirdos like that, too. It was scary just how strong and fast they were. Then they vanished, just like yours. We can't find any signs of hidden passages either. We'll continue our search. Schwarzer, speak with your allies about this. See if any of them have answers. We'll keep looking too. Be careful, everyone. Rain, I was just about to contact you. Is that so? I believe those agents may have been converted into night touched. The more accurate term is not familiar. They were a race of beings that appeared in Heimdall 200 years ago. They had superhuman strength and could travel along spirit paths at will. Sometimes they would take in powerful humans and convert them into their own. The night touched. That's right. I was finally able to map out Heimdall's spirit veins. They're arranged like a vortex, with the center somewhere in the northwest part of the city.
I heard what's happening. The northwest section of the city is where the turbulence is coming from, too. According to Zio, the epicenter is a tall building on top of a hill. So you've got an idea? We'll start heading there, then. We now begin our advance. I'll inform the others. Please, go on ahead. Instructor! We gotta get moving. Our destination is... Yeah, the Imperial Museum in the Laika District. We'll be going to the Laika District as soon as we're prepared. We could stop by the department stores and such on the way. Just as long as we hurry. There doesn't seem to be anything abnormal about the city. Not on the surface, at least. Let's check the museum. Today. Yes. This can't be a coincidence, given the strangeness going on underground. We'll need to contact the military police, or even the Heimdall Cathedral.
I'm seeing there is a situation. It's a bit far. However, the spirit veins are extremely active right now. I shall search for a simple spirit path I might use to get to you. I've located your mana. We should be able to speak telepathically from here on. This ain't right. Uh, it's giving me the creeps. I know this feeling. <gasps> what? It's everywhere. Are these the catacombs? No. Space itself has been warped here. Probably due to that gate and all this scarlet pleroma grass. That gate. It resembles the one in the island ruins. Ah, the soul shrine, was it? One of the shrines built all over Erebonia by the people known as the gnomes. Yeah, maybe... Ash? I don't get what's going on, but these flowers are the cause of all this crap, right? So let's just whack a few of these damn weeds! Hey! Oh, you're so reckless. Well, if it works, then... The hell? They grew back? Due to the strong magical energies here, I would guess. B but then, how do we... Everyone, look! Members of the Hercules Squad! Hey, this ain't good, is it? They almost look like they're sleepwalking. This is what Emma was talking about! The Night Touched! Everyone, prepare for battle! They're coming! This one might be worth my time! It's my turn! Uh, spirit Unification! Let's go! Let's go! Raging Fire Formation! It's my turn! Down. Now! Too slow! My turn! Not today! For real? I'm up! Break through! Sledgehammer! It's my turn! It's down! Too slow! My mind is clear. My blade empty. Now! Ah! 
That was foolish. It's my turn! Good luck! <laughs> Leave it to me! Today! <laughs> Not today! My 
turn. Yes! I'll leave it to you. Leave it to me! Spirit Unification! It's my turn! Roar! Feel it Sure. Those were some good moves, Ash. <laughs> you expect anything else? Yeah, I did it! I must train even more. <laughs> nice! <laughs> I grew a little. Their, their power and speed were beyond human. They were strong enough before, but now... It's as though they've completely lost their sense of self. Get back! Ah! Ah! Bastards! Clown Zaleus! What's going on? It's like they're living corpses. <sighs> Put all your power into your attacks! Think of them as puppets! Remember everything you've learned up till now! Uh. Damn it! No need to tell us that! <laughs> Passing mark. Huh? It's her. You see, there is a method to suppress these loathsome creatures. It is rather simple. You only need to temporarily sever their chi from their bodies. Schwarzer, new class seven. Know this, the current situation is even worse than you may imagine. What lies ahead of you is the nest where it slumbers. The calamity that destroyed Heimdall 900 years ago will reawaken soon. Uh, that's... You mean the legendary dark dragon? Are you saying it wasn't destroyed? No. It was, indeed, slain 800 years ago, at the hand of Emperor Hector's Vermilion Knight. But after the Vermilion Castle appeared, and those fools started taking action, its corpse began to stir. Now, the curse of the land gains power, and the dragon's body is rebuilding itself. It is the greatest and most terrible cryptid of all, capable of swallowing the entirety of Heimdall in its darkness. Screw that! That may have been possible back then, but now? 
the beast can chain down human souls to create a nearly endless number of night touched. The destruction 200 years ago was caused by only a handful of people exposed to the miasma. However, if it were to spread through Heimdall like a plague, what would happen? It would be a pandemic. <laughs> Are you serious? Use these well. I must take care of my own mission. My covenant from ancient times still holds. You can do as you wish. Emma and company will be here before long. Oh. Uh, hold on. So are you really Emma's? Wait! Can you at least tell me your name this time? If possible, I'd like to hear it from you. Hmm. <laughs> Very well. I am the elder of the Hexen clan, Roselia Milstein. Emma's grandmother, Celine's creator, and the one who taught Vita everything she knows. But you may call me Rose. Farewell for now. Uh... uh... This some kind of joke? She was kidding about being Emma's grandmother, right? Well, they're not related by blood, but... Anyway, one thing's for certain. Heimdall is facing a crisis. <laughs> yes. Reen! Oh. This is... Uh, what is this overwhelming miasma? It reminds me of the Infernal Castle. I presume those are the Calvardian agents. Those strips of paper! What in the world is going on here? Alright, so... What in the world? Night touched? So you're saying they could spread throughout the whole city? This is way past bad. It's gonna do a heck of a lot more than just cause a panic. Yeah, but it'd be impossible to evacuate all of Heimdall in time. You said Emma's grandma went in there already? Emma, is she really the elder of the Hexen clan? Yes, she certainly is. The night touched have been a big concern of her since ancient times. She said she was going to take care of them herself, but maybe she changed her mind, considering she gave you those talismans. I was wondering, what are these things? They're night touch sealing talismans. I've heard those strips of paper were developed after the incident 200 years ago. I'm sure you'll find them extremely useful up ahead. I take that to mean we'll be encountering more of these night touched on the other side of that gate. Yeah. I'm sure there will be quite a number of them waiting for us. Considering everyone who disappeared during our underground cleanup operation. And I have a feeling there will be plenty of other fiends besides. Yes, undoubtedly. You should consider the Dark Dragon Sanctuary even more dangerous than the Infernal Castle. Yeah, but, so what if it is? You're right. Even if it's more dangerous than the Infernal Castle, we've all grown a lot since then. Mm-hmm. In mind and body. I know I've been practicing my orbital staff tons. If the castle was meant to reenact a disaster from the Middle Ages, this is simply the same thing, but from the Dark Ages instead. Heimdall may be a city with some dark shadows and bad history, but it's also my hometown. As a member of Class 7, a guardian of the Blaze, and for the sake of my grandmother. Though noblesse oblige may be a dying creed, I shall fulfill my duty and put an end to this threat. 
Protecting the safety of the people is what bracers do. As a member of Class 7, and a friend of Erebonia, I'll put everything I have into this. Ooh, me too, me too! Even if the rest of the Intelligence Division is sitting back for now. <laughs> you guys. We're not going to sit back either. I'll show you what I've gained during my time in Class 7. And the soul of the Special Support Section, too. This is one of my hometowns, and I shall put both my blades and my family's name on the line to defend it. I think I finally see the purpose of my inclusion in Class 7. For Elise, the Princess, and my dear instructor, and for my very own path as well. It's about time we get to show off how much we've caught up to you. Yeah, this time, we won't differentiate between old and new. We are all members of Class 7. You too, Celine. Let's go! Of course. <laughs>